The Duke of Sussex sat down with Angela Levin, a royal biographer, in 2017 for a tell-all interview which showed his dissatisfaction with royal life. Prince Harry longed for an ordinary life away from the royal family long before he and his wife Meghan walked away in 2020, a recently unearthed interview has revealed. The Duke of Sussex sat down with Angela Levin, a royal biographer, in 2017 for a tell-all interview that showed his dissatisfaction with royal life. In the interview, he divulged that he had a long-standing desire to leave the royal, but added that he stayed within the firm out of loyalty to his late grandmother Queen Elizabeth II. In an interview with the Mail on Sunday, the Duke revealed he once wanted out of the royal family and yearned for an ordinary life. Duh. Harry and Meghan quit their royal duties in 2020 citing constant media scrutiny and the strictures of their roles before moving to California. Buckingham Palace confirmed that the couple would be stepping down a year later, with Harry confirming his long-standing problems with his royal role in the bombshell memoir Spare, published earlier this year. When speaking to Levin, the Duke also opined that the royal family will need to be revamped. He said, we feel that the British public and the whole world needs institutions like this, but it can't go on as it has done under the Queen. Queen Elizabeth had spoken to Harry and confirmed that in stepping away from the work of the royal family, it is not possible to continue with the responsibilities and duties that come with a life of public service, Buckingham Palace revealed in A. As part of the withdrawal from their duties, Harry and Meghan no longer use the His, Her Royal Highness, HRH, as a title but kept their Duke and Duchess of Sussex honors. The pair now reside in Montecito, California with Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet, who were granted the Prince and Princess titles as part of King Charles's ascension to the throne last year.